Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Tonight I'm gonna to be showing you my nighttime skincare routine, featuring my favorite products to take off my makeup and then to layer to give me overnight regeneration. First, I'm gonna be starting with the G Beauty Brightening Water, which is a water-based toner to help remove the first layer of makeup. I'm wearing my makeup from earlier in the day, which I applied more of to go out at night, so this is gonna remove that first layer before cleansing. The brightening water has hyaluronic acid, it has a little bit of vitamin C, licorice to brighten up my complexion, but most importantly, it has removing properties of the makeup from earlier today. Next, I'm gonna go in with cleanser to really cleanse my skin. Now, I'm a big believer in using the brightening water first before cleansing to remove makeup. The cleanser can only really wash your face or take off makeup, it can't do both. So you wanna make sure that your complexion is smooth and clean before actually using your face wash to wash your skin. I'm gonna tie my hair back and go in with one of my favorite cleansers. It's called the Dr. Barbara Sturm Enzyme Cleanser and it's a powder that I mix with water. So I put about two big squirts into my hand, mix it with a little bit of water, rub it in between my hands and cleanse my skin. So this is a rice powder that's helping to lift up the dead skin, the impurities, the oil buildup, and it also helps to really get in my pores where I have a lot of blackheads. To remove, I'm gonna take a warm washcloth and wipe away the cleanser. And now my skin is prepped and ready for skincare. So a lot of people ask me what to use at night and it really depends on your skin type and what you wish to achieve. What's most important is that you layer your skincare products in order. You always wanna go from thinnest to thickest in terms of consistency. I also tell clients that whatever the biggest concern of their skin is, that should be the first thing they target when they apply their products. For me, my first concern is my pores and my breakouts. So I am going to use the Sunday Riley Good Jeans Lactic Acid Serum. Good Jeans is one of my favorite products and it almost works instantaneously. Lactic acid is a really fine acid that works to shrink the pores, break up any pigmentation, and also soften texture. So I take about two pumps of the Good Jeans, rub it into my fingers, and blend it into my skin. I love this serum because I can feel it activating right away. It's a gentle tingle, and you can also use this as a mask if it's too strong for you to use at night. So my first layer is gonna be my active serum that I massage as deep as I can. I also believe that massaging products into the skin activates the ingredients. So the more you can massage it, the more active the serum will become. Next, I'm gonna show you one of my favorite tricks, which is the gua sha tool. I try to use this tool every night. I find it really helps with the inflammation in my skin and gets the circulation going. It's best applied with an oil. So because I have oily skin, I'm just gonna use a little bit just to get the motion going. I'm gonna use the Dr. Sabah Rose de Vie Serum, which is one of my favorites for hydration, anti-redness, anti-inflammation, but most of all, it's actually very lightweight. So I'm just gonna use a little, because I am oily, just a little drop on my hands. I'm gonna apply it all over my skin and come in with my gua sha. So the gua sha is a Chinese technique that helps to remove inflammation in the skin. So you take the gua sha flat onto the face and push it outwards and upwards into the hairline. This is gonna push out any excess water retention. It's gonna actually move any bacteria underneath the skin. And I really find it sculpts my face. I see the biggest difference when I use my gua sha at night. It also helps to get the flow so that the skincare can be better absorbed into my pores. Coming up and out, you can push upwards to create sculpt in the cheekbone, and then you can push down into the neck, which is where the lymphatic drainage exists, to push that water out that's causing you any puffiness into the face. Because I do believe in layering hydration, I'm going to add a little bit of the Dr. Sabah Replenishing Cream. This is a moisturizer that's perfect for all seasons. It's not too heavy. And for me, it just helps to control my oil because when I overly exfoliate, we strip the skin of that oil that it needs to balance and to hydrate. So just a little bit, 
goes a very long way. As you can see, my skin is a little bit red just from the lactic acid and the movement of the gua sha, which is important because overnight your skin cells are gonna regenerate, so they need a little bit of acid and movement to get the process going. One of my favorite products that I always talk about is the Dr. Sabah Supreme Eye Serum. Like I mentioned before, serums are way more active than any moisturizer could ever be. An eye serum like this one is gonna hold 90% active ingredients and only 10% water. So it's really active in anti-aging, hydrating, thickening the collagen and depuffing. The product's really cool because it has a silver rolling ball which will create that anti-inflammation and it will also help to penetrate the product deeper into my skin. I take the roller and apply it right underneath the eye and I come right underneath my brow bone and I rock it back and forth until it's completely absorbed into my skin. You're gonna press out for a little bit more product and come right back underneath the eye to underneath the brow bone. If there's extra product, you can just take your fingers and penetrate it by pressing it in. Similar to my morning, I still give a lot of TLC to my lips. This is the SkinCeuticals Antioxidant Lip Repair, which is basically skincare for your mouth and lips. The lips don't have oil glands, so you have to make sure that you're properly hydrating them with the right ingredients. This product has hyaluronic acid, resveratrol, which is one of my favorite ingredients to thicken up the skin, and vitamin C. So I take the lip repair and I blend it into my lips, and then I come across the upper lip and right underneath the bottom lip to prevent and correct fine lines. Now, if we had more time, I would do a full mask for you and remove it, but in the interest of saving time and being quick on our feet, this is my favorite product. This is the Dr. Sabah Skin Perfecting Mask. It's a mix of clay and salicylic to decongest, get rid of the bacteria and the excess oil and shrink up the pores. Last but not least are my lashes. I like to take really good care of my lashes and I like to help them be as thick and long as possible. This is the Grande Lash MD, which is a lash serum that you can just apply to the lash line to give you that extra thickness and density in your lashes. It's a magnesium-based treatment, which is an excellent protein to really help the lashes get thicker and stronger. Before bed, I like to make sure everything has been moisturized, so I take a little bit of hand cream. This is the Dr. Sabah High Maintenance Hand Cream, and I'll just take a little and massage it into my hands. I'll often put this on my elbows. Even on your feet is really beautiful to give your skin that extra TLC, and it is proven that a little bit of massage can really relax the muscles and in fact, anti-age. Now that my routine is all complete, I'm just gonna let my skin breathe, watch a movie, and go to bed.